so we have our model here in twin motion i had shown you in the previous one now you can be able to export it here and i leave a link and in this one i just want to show you how you can be able to apply textures on your drawing once you apply textures how can you create shorts pictures let's say pictures or scenes then once you create them how can you be able to export that is pictures and videos okay and we will try to go different to different templates like this drawing usually when you open your drawing this way you get different templates for night day and stuff so i'll also try to show you how you can be able to manipulate those so for this one for starters you have different textures here on materials you can click on materials and you choose the material that you want say stone brick ground floor so for now let me go to walls wall coverings and i can now apply like this kind of material let's say i want to change this one to be yeah so that is more like noise white and maybe for me i want it to be purely white so i come to this side and i click on color and i can just i can do some adjustment to make it purely white okay so there are many tricks that you can be able to do here i can also like drop it here and maybe change it to be click on it and change it to be more darker and you can also play around with um let me come closer if you see this is how this looks like this is the material we applied on this it looks more like it has some grandness and yeah maybe you want it to be so soft okay so if i want to click on it i click here on the pencil and i click on it then you will have selected that material now i can come and do scale zero okay then i can come and reduce roughness to zero say maybe you did sanding very well so it's just smooth then i can increase maybe metallicness but don't increase it too much because you will turn it into a metal you want it to have some reflection or some glossiness but it is this is nice when you use on the interior walls yeah so maybe i'm not okay with this texture here and i want to apply a different one say i want like this i can just drop it there or i want the bluish one yeah so it is quite simple twin motion is very simple and you can choose from a variety of different textures if i come to brick i can be able to choose different types of bricks that you have here and again you can be able to at, at, do at, adjustment on the scale let me say i chose this one all you have to do is click on it and drag it and drop it where you want so let me say i dropped it here and it looks very 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 small and maybe i'm not okay with it this way so you come on this other end and you want to look for something called scale once you find the scale you can try to do at adjustment on the same and maybe you are not okay with the scale in terms of uh, x and y you can click on details and you can now do more in terms of x maybe you want x to be div more like let's say this or i want y to stretch less or stretch more okay so it comes with a lot of options that you can be able to do and this one is usually nice if you want to look for block sizes for those people who build using blocks and also when you use um I usually use this other option on switching X and Y and uh, when I'm using when I go to if you come to uh, mega scans if you come to mega scans you can be able to download more textures and uh, let me show you so let me say I want bricks more brick textures I click on brick and modern so you have to have your internet on and it will show you more textures that you can be able to download or you can go through and choose the ones you like then once you find there is a guy who keeps on asking me hey man how can i make my wall look this way i don't know and i keep on telling him you just place on textures but it seems like he feels like i'm not telling him everything but you can download say i want this one i just click on 
download the most important things to make sure you have signed in and to sign in if you log in via twinmotion via epic games you will be signed in automatically but if you did you did not log in via twinmotion via epic games then you want to come to to files and you want to come and check whether you have been signed in or not yeah okay so now you can download this will depend on the speed of your internet and you can try to see so for now i don't have any downloaded ones because i just installed this in motion about a day ago for the purpose of this tutorial and yeah but i usually use it it's, it is just that my pc it keeps on crashing and failing to start windows i have a problem with my my hard disk i need to replace my ssd so it uh, windows keeps on failing and mountable disk volume eh? so then i have to reinstall programs afresh usually after every week or after two weeks it sucks a lot but i'm looking for money to do that so you just click on the one you downloaded and you try to place it where you want it to be if you're okay with it that way then you're okay but if you want again you can do ad adjustments in this way in the x and y say x i can choose something like 0 0.68 then uh, you can try to see if you're okay with it or not then why i can try to do less or i can try to do more just play around with them to find something that suits your needs this is too tiny this is a somehow okay then i can do like this and i end up with something that is almost block in shape but not really a block but you can try here you have multiple textures here lots of them and not just bricks you have a lot in terms of let me download plaster i want fresh and let me choose to go facade this is called facade but for us where we come from we can read it as facade and no one will do anything to us but you but you're supposed to read read it as facade facade or facade so I see the downloads now I can maybe show you other things like I've shown you how you can be able to place a texture and you can also vary this this is the ground you can click on it and you will see an arrow somewhere here so you can decide to pull it up or downwards depending with how you are you did draw your house and again uh, let me say i wanted to change the color of this guys at the top you just pick a pick a text then you drop on them and you can be able to change the texture now to go to if you want to export like i said if you click we click on the media we have populate materials import materials populate media so once you click on the media you will be see this you will be able to see this automatically this is these are from the template or oh, this one is done let me show you so i can drag it and pull it here and maybe i'm not okay with it so i can try to increase the scale but i think the one we had looked much better yeah but yeah we can leave it that way and what else what else i can maybe make this bottom one to be black so all i have to do is to choose the pencil click on it and i can say let me make it blackish that is if you don't want to change the you don't want to pull another text on it or you can change it to any color that you want here okay then you hit okay and if you want you can go ahead and do more in terms of roughness in terms of scale metallicness which will affect the reflection once you're done with it uh i was showing you on the images so if i'm okay you can you, you can come and try different multiples like this one are you okay with it or not if you're not okay with it you can try to do different things here like rotating the moon 
and let me show you let me show you you want to rotate exposure but you can try to adjust exposure then it will bring in more light into your scene maybe if that is what you want then I can try to uh -huh. I want to show you something else that is a little bit cooler no 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 i think it's in hdri environment here yeah. you can try to rotate the direction of the moon let me reduce the exposure first okay let's say we have exposure somewhere there so if you rotate the direction of the moon you can see that it uh, brings light in different cases or you can also vary the intensity okay there are many options that you can be able to do you can click on another one and another until you find one that maybe you are okay with say if i was okay with two or one say i was okay with one the way it is so and this one at the bottom it doesn't look cool let's try to do Initially it was white, so let's do something black. Even black is not that nice. Or we can do, say you want the same text as this, you just click on it and you pick it from here and I drop it here. And now we can have that. So we were on image one, say we like image one. You do adjust it to where you want it to be the shot of your camera. Say I want it to be there. Then you can either choose to refresh this one if I click here then I will be able to refresh it as you can be able to see or you can just click on plus and you add another image at the bottom now you come to this image and you use it to get another position and again you take another shot then you do that to any other position that you want and again you take another shot so then as you can as you do these adjustments you can try to also manipulate different parameters depending on the shot that you have say i'm not okay with this one i can try and do maybe exposure or the best option is to ro do rotation of this yeah? so that it brings your sun at a different location and it will be able to do justice to your picture and you can also try to vary maybe the intensity many more things and if you don't want to have the sky dome you can just switch it off here or with a uh, one click here and it goes away and now you can only you can do your own ad adjustments in terms of location maybe where are you where are you located which month is it you can be able if you change the month it will change then things that you want but of course this is not applicable in africa where we are not affected by months a lot yeah let me return it on what else what else what else what else then say you don't want the ground to look this way you can come to materials then you go to ground the nature and you can pull in some grass but remember when it comes to the ground you're supposed to do modeling in Archicad on the how do we call it landscaping you're supposed to do a very nice landscape design in Archicad before you bring your drawing here that way it will look much better but already you can see that my drawing looks nice then i can take another shot here and say i'm okay with this shot and i want to do a camera shot here a video one so I can pull it closer or further depending with what you want then you click on this icon for video and I can click on plus and now all I have to do is to move my camera closer and it will take my shot for me then if I hit play you can see how the shot will look like so you can do multiple shots depending on what you want what you feel like yeah then once you're done you click on uh, export then once you click on export it will show you this side so you come and you click on the plus icon to choose the images that you want you are remember to choose your images that you created 
not the ones from the not these ones so for me i can choose 27 28 29 and 30 then you click on the video again you choose on the ones you created which is one and you can export them at the same time or different different depending on what you want then i can click on export so there are main you can do a lot of things let, let me just continue let me continue not explain on i wanted to explain more on quality of videos and quality of pictures but let's just do a, a, a export so you click on start export and you will choose the location where you want your drink to go so this is where i, I did export my last drawing maybe you want to create a but for ours was going on in a folder called class i think new folder eight then class oh am i wrong looks like i'm wrong but let's just place it in um oh it is so i can say new folder here and we click on it and select folder then all you have to do is to chill and wait for your computer to do its thing and it it will do it very quickly when you're using twin motion it does it very very quick so in the meantime i will see you in the next one let me end it here